our journey began in 2008 um, from the reviews and recommendations of the National Numeracy Review Report. In that, one of the first and most important recommendations was the establishment of academic partners, which we did with Australian Catholic University and now Monash University. They assisted us in leading and developing leadership programs for all our principals and system leaders in our diocese. From that, we used a mathematics assessment interview, a diagnostic instrument for every student in our primary schools and a percentage of students in our secondary schools. From that data, we were able to identify every student of where they're at on the continuum upon entry into school and all the way through to year six and seven. That data serves as a basis for developing professional learning for our leaders, but also for our teachers about high yield, um, effective strategies in all areas of mathematics. And it's also led to the beginning of a second wave intervention program, affectionately known as EMU. EMU is extending mathematical understanding. So it's the research that we have a partnership with, uh, Anne Jeversoni with, um, she's been through ACU Ballarat. And Anne's been leading leaders of numeracy so that they can come back into the schools and then also build the capacity of our classroom teachers. EMU is a specialised program that um, really targets those children who are um, needing extra support within maths so and it's really an accelerated program so we're looking for accelerated growth. It's a 10 to 20 week program it's five days a week for half an hour each day and it's a group of three children that come out for that program. The time that the children spend with us is um, a warm-up, so it, it almost mirrors what's happening in the classroom. And then it might be a game or a, a skill that we're practising or an open investigation. And then the children have some individual reflection time where we fill in their diaries or their journals for overnight. And that's another form of communication with home as well, so they can go home and explain what they've done during the time with us and build on that during their homework time. So the EMU specialist teachers are always on hand to give us vital information on the children they particularly work with but also to give us the bigger picture on how the students in our school are progressing. They have a rich um, understanding of the data. We often will also go and um, sit in on the EMU specialist teachers lessons so that gives us a clear um, understanding of where the children they are working with, where they are at their particular time of their learning and that also gives us another um, insight to the questioning and the types of activities we can give the children to support them in their learning. One less. One less. Can you do it without taking the equipment away? Tell me, what would the answer be? They get that positive reinforcement and they're actually able to take learnings that they understand from being part of the EMU program back to the classroom and share it with their peers and it gives them that confidence as well. I came straight out of university into the EMU program, so all of the, um, the challenges that some of the other teachers faced about having to shift over to the EMU way of thinking, I didn't have to experience that because it was the first year for me was the first year for the school, so it meant that it was really authentic and I was in straight away. Um, the, all the learning and development that we've done at this school has been really powerful. Um, I've been lucky enough to go on multiplicative thinking um, workshops and stage three learning days with um, other stage three teachers and it just gives me an opportunity to um, develop my knowledge and bring all of those um, activities that we do on those days back into the classroom. I think the professional learning experience that um, we've been through has been very personalised. So we personalise the, the learning for our children. Um, but the learning that we have been through has been that it's targeted the needs of our students and it hasn't been sort of one size fits all. The teachers are, are more excited each year. Every time they look at the data, they're excited because they can see that it's making a difference to the students. They can see that um, when they go into the classrooms, they're a lot more confident because we're all working together in our professional learning, they've got colleagues that they can bounce their ideas off. They've got people that they can go to at any given time, any time that they're, they're stuck. So you can see a definite build of confidence. Um, teachers uh, have a better understanding of what they're teaching and there's a lot more consistency in a whole school approach to our numeracy than it was before.